Hi and welcome to SQL Injection Master Course. My name is Hitesh and I hope you are quite familiar with me if you are following up with the, all the series right now. So this lesson is quite interesting as well. So let's take a look at what we have got in the challenge number 21. So the great thing about this series is challenges along with the solutions as well, isn't it? So we have got a lesson 21 again and I have to repeat all the things again. I have to move it from root desktop lesson 21 to slash war www master. Once I do that, I will unzip the contents of lesson 21.zip. Everything is set. Rest of the things are just from the last lesson, so I don't need to start my Apache and my SQL again. So I'll again go back to lesson number 21. It says lesson 21. Please input the IDS parameter with numerical value, a quite friendly uh, invitation to hack into the website. Also, we have got uh, a hint that says your input is filtered with the following result. Yes, I can understand you have been focusing quite a lot on this image, but uh, the files are with you. You can concentrate on this image later on. But what we have got right now here is your input is filtered with the following result. So let's check it out what this is actually talking about. So question mark ID equals one. And if I do that, it gives me sum and sum that is being username. If I give it a two, okay, some other user. But what happens if I hit a single quote? Okay, it gives me an error. Okay, I was quite happy with this error. I put a hyphen hyphen minus that is query delimiters than a plus sign. You can also put a space or I hope you are quite aware with the previous lessons. Okay, so the query got fixed. Now eventually when I was doing a order by one here, I noticed something very interesting. So as I do an order, there is an error that says, uh, check the manual that corresponds near to something something and to use near DER by one. Now, whenever first time in my life I saw this error, I was quite confused. Hey, I'm writing order by one. I'm quite sure because I have written that in the URL, but it gives me error near DER by one. Now, what is that? For a couple of days, I was quite confused that why my OR part is being separated from the DER. Then eventually I realized, let us uh, go back and realize what happened actually by looking at the source code, index.html. And if I go back a bit, oops, I'm in the wrong file. I have to travel into the lesson 21. And here I have to do a quick ls, open up my index.php. And if I go a bit down, I have used the function here that is a very good one. Here it is. Now here the function is actually a blacklist function, which give what it does if I find an or and if I find an n, it just replaces it. Now this is actually the thing that might have been using out here. Also I have given you a hint, uh, the result order by two. What I have done here is only separated this part of the query, but actually this was the query that gave me a pop-up in my head that, hey, this might be the problem. So let us try to proceed in some other way so that we can realize that yes, things are not working quite well or one equals one. Or let's just be, just put it, let's or equals one. If I do that, so nothing is working. Our or is being filtered and says two single quote one. What happens if I do an end? Okay, things are not working. What in case if I do some extraordinary smart list like this? Okay, things are not working again. So what could be the solution of this? The solution is very simple and you might, uh, some of you might have taken down this solution already. So in place of or and and, you can use the notations that you be, you can you simply use. For example, I can put up two pipe sign as an or and can hit enter. So you can see things are working, but really sometimes things might be working and sometimes it's not. So let's try with the end as well, end. And if I give it a one, now this gives me an error, but if I do a zero, it again gives me error. Now, are the things really working? What do you say about it? Now, this can be really, really a typical thing. 
0 or 1 so got the point because it was or so one part was the true so it was true so whether you put a 0 or trend or not so the testing reel comes at the end so here it says 1 things are not working and if I hit a 0 things are not working so what could be the solution of this simple problem the solution is the URL encoding since we were being using the address sign the the logical or and you can say the logical the logical end is being directly being used and it should not be used directly you should have used a person 26 instead of that and likewise you should have used uh, or in the similar fashion that is person 7c so this was a quick solution of this challenge i hope you can proceed after this this is really a simple after this particular hint and uh, that's all for this video and thank you so much for watching and keep enjoying the sql injections